Hey guys, oh, welcome back to Genji Plans. Uh, today I'm doing a flip through video for March 2021. I had to think about that for a second, my goodness. Um, I'm still in my mode term A7. Um, I like it, it's working well. I still really like that I can have all of my wallet stuff here in the back. Obviously, I'm not going to show that to you. But the back pocket also, oh yeah, there's like some insurance cards in the back here. So this is all wallet stuff. The front has pockets also. I barely ever open this zipper. I believe I have like one quarter in there. I never use uh, cash these days. There's some stickers that are in here. These are the tiny little dots from Twin 16. Um, the rest of this set, because it came in like a little bundle, um, are here. Then I've got the washi card, and this is a, a sampler or two from Planner Kate. So it's nice that there's some stickers that fit in the front pocket. The rest of my po uh, stickers are in the back. So I just like to keep some of these around with me if I'm planning on the go or whatever. Um, these are some notes for a video game that I don't want to lose. And then there's a check. Uh, so yeah, let's let's begin. I, I keep saying this. I'm pretty sure that Marlene's Plan to Create, where I got these frosted tabs and um, this flyleaf, has closed. I can't find her online anymore. But I do like it, anyway. Um, and then these uh, black and white acetates are from um, Peanuts Planner Co. Then we jump right in with my monthly. So this is insert 14 from my shop. I did a monthly plan with me video. I always do monthly plan with me videos. If you didn't know that, um, welcome. This uh, flip through that I do every single month is usually one of my highest viewed videos. So I betcha that there's a lot of people here who aren't subscribed. Hi, if you like what you see, stick around. I do one of these every month as well as a whole weekly plan with me. I do a monthly plan with me as well as a lot of other topics. So anyway, welcome. This is March. I went with sort of a spring-like theme. Um, the This One Thing One Year tracker from um, My Summer Touch is tracking my one line a day journal, which I need to catch up on. I'm a little bit farther than this, but I'm not sure, but I do need to catch up. Um, and then the Bible in a Year podcast. I just, you know, it's printed on the back. Might as well. This is the Level 10 Life insert. I think it's insert five from my shop. Anyway, I uh, haven't redone it for March. But not that much change between January and March, and I already knew what my goal for the month was going to be. I needed to file our taxes. I filed it on the thir Thursday night, like after the stimulus bill was passed. And then we got our check or our stimulus deposit like Friday morning. So unfortunately, our daughter, who was just born last year, she's going to have to keep waiting for her 1400 Anyway, uh, waiting on list here. And then these three top tabs are for projects. The first one is like the project for the month, which I don't think I mentioned. This is insert 11 that has my monthly resolutions. Instead of setting a, a yearly resolution, I like to send one, set one for each month. So the first tab is for that first goal and I already finished it and I didn't want you to see a list of all of our bank accounts. So I moved it out of here already. Um, then tab two is my garden planning. This is the layout for the spring and summer, which we're slowly moving towards, but we've got some more cold weather lately, so it's going to be a little bit longer. A general to-do list of things that as they come up, I, there's some things I need to do in the garden. I've been dealing with aphids, so I need to deal with that. These are notes for a game I play, and I'm not proud. Um, this is my cover. This first tab is for my weeklies, so we've got my two beautiful girls, um, and this month I'm using insert 28, which is new from my shop. I just published it last month. Uh, it's got these, the fold over faux Dutch door thing. So you've got your weekly and your dailies here and I'm liking it. It's a lot of fun. This is the one that I did the weekly plan with me video of. You can see, yeah, I mean, like this, the idea is you're supposed to sort of be able to like peek out these stickers. I got these stickers from Amazon and I linked them in the bottom of the, this video, I think. Um, but I can find them again if you need them. But yeah, they're, uh, <laughs> they're a lot of fun. And then this week I went with the sort of more like browns as well as the, like last week was grays. This week I have browns, but obviously it's green cause it's St. Patrick's day. I'm filming this yesterday. Hello. It's, it's a crazy week for like events and stuff because it's my sister's birthday, my daughter's half birthday, St. Patrick's Day, our roommate's birthday, St. Joseph's Day, all in one week. 
And then we have one more week of April. And it's crazy because the week after is Holy Week. <laughs> and I don't know where the time has gone. Um, things got moved out of here because they got finished. And so I have like extra tabs and I don't want to just like not have them in here. They may as well have something. So tab number two is where my meal plan lives. This is insert number 27 from my shop. Um, I didn't do a new one for this week because we had a lot of extra food and I don't think we're going to need to do another grocery order this week. I think it can wait till the weekend. So I'm on the next week section right now. Corn beef is in the crock pot today. And then these are all of my milk logs. I did a whole video about how I track my milk supply and what I'm trying to do to boost it. I don't know if you want to stop, pause and look at the numbers. It hasn't been ideal. <laughs> I've added an evening pumping session again, so we're still working on it. It's it's a thing, but the baby started on solids, which might be part of it. I don't know. Who knows? Also, six months was when it started to, my supply started to go down with my first daughter also. Next section is reference. So I've got this uh, sticky note index. Uh, we've got library books, but I'm not tracking due dates because my library doesn't have due dates during COVID, which is kind of nice. Um, then my to watch list. So this is what I want to watch by myself. I haven't redone it in a long time. I probably could and get rid of all the stuff that I have watched. It's not a big deal because I still have room. And then on the back is the stuff I want to watch with my husband. And he watched this without me, so I moved it. <laughs> um, then just a, a list of gift ideas and a general wish list for myself. And then the next tab, this one is not from Peanuts Planner Co. This one's from Michael's. Uh, I've got a brain dump page, a general inbox, and then a someday maybe list, and a honeydew list on the back of that. Then um, this is my list of current works in progress, different crafting things. And then these have been in here for like a year now, um, at least. Since I started working on a baby blanket for my second daughter, it's not even halfway. It's this, it's this much done, and she's six months old, and I just have not been able to get up the, like, oomph to just pick up the needles again. Then in tab number five is my future log. This is from Peanuts Planner Co. I love this insert. I don't think I could try to improve on it myself, so I use it. I buy her a new bundle every year. And then this is the next year and afterwards section of the future log. I firmly believe in a yeah, and afterwards section for your future log because where else are you going to put your dentist appointment? Um, and then this next tab one, it's, you know, it's the same. If you've been here before, it hasn't changed, I don't think. Um, this is birthdays and anniversaries. I need to leave it folded the way it is. Recurring tasks. Um, I am almost done with this first page because there's only like two maybe more things after April um like as I plan May I think I'll probably move the last couple of things off here so like this is September so I'll move that April I'll do July I'll move April I'll do if that makes sense like and consolidate the list because we've moved on to page two now but I'm kind of liking this. It's just more straightforward and less finagling having to be done because everything has its own line. Um, and then the last page, or the last tab, has some sticky notes. These are my favorite sticky notes, and I will eventually run out of them, and it will be a sad day because I got these for the 99 cent store. And I don't know if they really make them or not. They're actual post-its, and they're actually two and a half by three. And they're not a ridiculous color, and I love them. Anyway couple tabs, flags, you know, a couple jot pads. I think I used one once and some spare paper. These are all inserts from my shop as well. This one and this one are freebies. And uh, you can find my shop at ganshi.plans. Ganshiplans.com slash shop. And uh, I already told you to subscribe, so if you haven't done that yet, then, you know, you know where the button is and ring the bell, and I'll see you in the next video on Sunday. Bye. Thank you.